Today we're gonna to be making some freshwater panfish. First, get some panfish meat. Now this is a, a, a bunch of different type of fish. This is a rock bass. Let's see, this is a perch. We probably got some bluegill in, yeah, it's a, no, it's a rock bass. We have some bluegill in here. It may be harder to find, but we do have a, some bluegill, maybe some walleye as well, so let's get cooking. Now since this stuff is from Canada, Rice Lake, we're gonna separate the meat from the skin. The skin is garbage, just so you know. Skin, meat, let's separate it. Now that you got all these scraps, you can just throw them away and make sure you just keep all the good meat. It's probably about 30 fish. It's pretty good. Now, since these are from Canada, we gotta keep the skins on. I probably already said this, but maybe I'm not. Uh, you gotta keep these skins on just so you, they know on the border what you're taking back. So, yeah, that's why. Normally, if I have fish from PA, I won't have to be doing this. So, yeah, let's get cooking. Real quick, before we start cooking, make sure you always stay safe. Um, yeah, just stay safe, don't burn your house down. Me personally, actually, I'm a firefighter. This is not my station, this is the 10 house in New York City. The first engine to respond to 9-11. So, yeah, just stay safe. Uh, YouTube, don't uh, delete this video because you see a person at the stove or night. So, yeah, stay safe. Don't get it too hot too fast. Now for the meat, we're gonna be using some powdered corn, that's what I call it, some eggs, some milk, some Old Bay, and some Cajun Josh Allen spice. Josh Allen, best QB in the nation. You're gonna need two bowls. Here's what I got. You're gonna put a little bit of, oh, there's that cup. A little bit of milk. A little bit of milk. to combine them together. See what happens. Now mix it all together. Take your slab of meat. Let's do this one for example. Dunk it in the milk. Egg, then go straight to the corn in Old Bay and Josh Allen. So, then lay it down. So we'll do, and do that for about every single piece of meat. Again, be super careful with dealing with oil. You can get very dangerous very really fast. Make sure you keep it on a low heat. And you should be safe. Maybe three or four minutes. Let's see if we can flip them over and see what they look like. Shouldn't be too hot on the other side. 
Should be about to sizzle again. I'm not very good at this. Well, I'll get them. Now that they're all flipped over, give them a couple more minutes. Preferably, I like mine extra crispy, so that's what I'm gonna do today. Again, be ultra safe. You can use a cooking glove, but I'm pretty good at scooping them out. Now it's not going to be a ton of meat because these are panfish. If you're like a, if you do walleye, they're going to have a really good, depending on the size obviously, you're going to have a lot more meat. Probably around the back strap of a deer, I have to say. Maybe not as thick, but probably longer. Depending on how big of a deer you also shoot. So, yeah, now we just have to do that a couple more times. Man, does that look amazing. Wow. Now, some good old Chick-fil-A sauce. Not sponsored, by the way. Chick-fil-A sauce. Some nice slabs. Oh, goodbye. Back to the lobby. Some nice slabs. And does that not look amazing? It may look a little bit like chicken nuggets, but it's a lot better, trust me. Just try it. You guys gotta try this at home. If you guys got a, a local pond that you can eat the fish from, I 100% recommend. Let's give it a try. A little nugget in the Chick-fil-A sauce. Not too many other foods better than that. Well, besides Marco, Marco's Pizza. If you guys are ever in Buffalo, New York, small town arcade, go to Marco's Pizza and Subs. Best place in the world. Now, while I'm eating this, uh, Huge thank you to our sponsor of today's video and the YouTube channels, and that is Rugged Meats. Now, Rugged Meats might be better than this fish, I'm not gonna lie. This is amazing, but Rugged Meats is also amazing, so it's definitely up there. Maybe if I dip some Chick-fil-A sauce in my Rugged Meats. Rugged Meats is probably better, but I love fish, so yeah. But huge thank you to them. Use code JADEN10 to get 10% off your order um 
I, my favorite flavor is Sunrise Maple. I got that memorized in my head because I just love it so much. Uh, yeah, can't really say too much. Uh, they are a uh, company here in the US that makes great meat sticks. Uh, thank you, Rugged Meats, for sponsoring today's video. Thank you. Come on, I'm gonna give her some. Come on, okay. Name my dog Sadie. She won't. Oh, okay, okay. You don't have to be scared. Good girl. Name Sadie. She's getting a haircut tomorrow. You want to try some food? A little bit of chicken nugget, fish nugget. What do you think? Roll. Back to her bed to munch it up. All right. I need to get more than that. There. Lunch of fuesos? No? Honest opinion. What do you rate it? Oh, you already had some, right? Yeah. What do you rate it? Five out of ten. Five out of ten. Not bad. Not bad. Hoping for more. But. This one? Want to take fly sauce? Sure. Pick your favorite. Give more if you want, but. Uh, Take a minute, chew it, give me your best. Well, what do you rate it? Honest opinion. Hmm. I feel like an 8.5. 8.5. Yeah. Pretty good. Let's bring down the last taste tester. The fish is one of them all. All right, the last taste tester is here. Do you want some chicken fly sauce? No. Yeah. Okay. All right. Grab some. You're not too much left. Alright, have some. Taste it. Give me your honest opinion. Like, rate it like 1 through 10. Okay? Chew it up. Nice. Ten out of ten. Best one yet, folks. You guys gotta try this. Thank you. You wanna eat some more with me? Mm -hmm. Sounds good. Alright folks, so I think this is going to be the end of the video. The fish is gone. Our bellies are full. We didn't even make enough fish. They're fighting over it. So yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Go to RuggedMeats.com. Use code Jaden10 to get 10% off at checkout. I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you go down and subscribe. So... Yeah, this isn't our everyday, this isn't a normal video, I was just stuck inside, uh, just bored, so I made this video for you guys, I was pretty hungry, craving fish, so this is what I came up with, so I hope you guys like this video, make sure you go down and subscribe, click the like, turn on notifications, I'll see you in the next one, go fishing when you can, see ya.